I made this application in Flutterflow, and while it looks good in light mode, how do I make it look good in dark mode as well? My name is Anya, and this is Original Strokes. Here I have a screen, and I've tried to choose one that had some different colors on it. Now, by default, when you create an application, if I go all the way down here, we can see that these are the colors they give us. We have this purple, and then some green, orange, and then gray. But what if these aren't the colors that I actually want? You can come up with your own color palette, but just to easily do this, I'm going to go to coolers, coolers.co, spelt like this. And we can see a bunch of different nice looking palettes already set. Just click the space bar to keep regenerating. Once you find one you like, then we want to go here to code. Now I'm going to go here to where it says object and just select this whole thing. Then I'm going to go here, click import from coolers and paste in this text from here. Now I'm going to click import. This uploads the colors like this so you can easily reach them. Well, what I want to do is set like this purple is the primary, this is the secondary, and this is the tertiary. All you need to do is go in here, and copy each of these accordingly. So I'm going to start with this purple and put this into the primary spot. I'm going to do that for each of the colors and check back when it's done. And done. So now we have all of our purples. I also went ahead and changed the utility colors. By setting the primary to this purple and changing all of these, when we go back to our builder, we see that all of these are changed as well. That's an amazing thing about Flutterflow. If we click on this container, we can see that its color is secondary. So no matter what I change that secondary color to, I can make it this red we will see that change reflected here. So it makes it really easy to keep your colors consistent throughout the building of your application. But if we go back here, we can see a couple other things that are interesting. One of which is this light up here, which says switch to dark mode. When I click on this, we're gonna see all these colors change. And I can click back and we see the actual colors. But how does this work? If we go back here, we see all of these colors relate to our light mode theme. If we go down here, we have these same exact controls for our dark mode theme, but we see things like primary text color become white and the background become dark. Working with dark mode requires some playing around with, but essentially here we have our secondary purple color, which we see over here. When we switch to dark mode, it chooses the secondary color from the dark mode. So right now this is purple. If I switch to dark mode, it becomes our teal color. And you can play around with that and try to get this to use the same colors like this, just rearrange slightly. For example, instead of using this black, I'm going to use the dark purple that we made up here. This is going to become our gray from up here, and I'm going to keep this white and gray. For these, the I'm going to keep the colors the same for now. but you might have to tweak it a little based on what the interactions between the colors look like. We can try this out, go back to build. This is what it looks like in dark mode. I think we can improve it a little. For example, make the primary background black. Now when we go back here, it looks a lot better and you can keep playing around with that. But what you saw is, this is Flutterflow makes it very easy to switch from light mode to dark mode, and this works on any page you make. So if I go back to the builder and I add any random page, let's add let's add this one and click my theme. This page will be added with my purple colors. Thank you for watching. I hope this was helpful.